Hi everyone, welcome back to advanced Excel session with Preeti. In today's session, we will understand how to write an if function with an or. It is very much similar to if and and function. So like I explained in, in the previous video, video of if and and function, you have to understand the scenario and the, uh, the conditions, whether you want to satisfy both the conditions or all the conditions then you will use AND function. If you want to satisfy any one of the condition, then you will use an OR function. So it's simply while you talk, you say, okay, I want this or this. So in such scenarios, you will use an OR function. And when you will say, I want both of the things, I want, you know, all the things present, then you want an AND function. So it's as simple as that. Just try to, you know, uh, create a sentence out of it. You understand which function to use. So in this scenario, let me quickly explain this example. I have a list of resources and I want to create zones for these resources. So let's take a very simple example. I want all the resources who are from east or who are from west. Notice me emphasizing on or. Okay, And that's why I'm using an or function here. And another way to notice is uh, I want nor east and west as one group as one zone so if you notice logically also it's not possible to use an and i cannot say so for example samita uh, i can't say samita is from east region as well as west region because it just gives me the uh, you know privilege of writing one region here right so hence you have to use or only in this scenario wherein you're saying either one of the condition is satisfied then give me this text as zone one and the remaining group should be zone 2. So let's see how that goes. It's similar to if and and combination. Nothing new. Just ensure that you're using or. Uh, like I explained in the and condition uh, in the previous video wherein we understood if and and combination. The logical test means we can use only one condition. We cannot write two conditions. Hence, we're using the uh, you know, we are taking the help of another function called OR. So, I will write OR, I will open bracket. Syntax is exactly same like AND function, okay? Just that the understanding or the functioning differs. So, here my condition is if a resource or an employee is from east or west region. So, I will select this cell and I will say east. I will and close it in double inverted quotes to go to the next section I'll put a comma notice how the bold area goes to the logical 2 now I'm supposed to write the second condition my second condition also exists in the same column so I'm again going to select b2 why b2 again because you're writing the function for this row hence it will always be in the row 2 and the column you will decide based on whatever the condition is so you'll say b2 equals to east and west or oh sorry east or west right so i'll say east or west and i'll close the bracket as soon as i do that my or function is completed and i'm again taken to if function to proceed further i need to put a comma value if true then it is zone 1 and the remaining resources I want to put it under zone 2. Okay, now uh, this is a simple if or combination but there can be scenarios wherein let's say you have more than 4 regions or you know uh, maybe 5, 6 regions, northeast, southeast, you have various combinations and you want to create various zones. So uh, you also can do that by using a nested if, we will be doing that in our further session but just to keep this example very simple. I am just writing the remaining resources as zone 2. Any which ways in this scenario, if you will notice, it is just north, east, west, south. So, the remaining 2 is north and south and they will automatically go to zone 2. This is just to keep it simple enough. We will be seeing how to do nested uh, if functions in the further sessions. So, that is it. I am done. And as you notice, the syntax help is disappeared. That means my function is perfect. There is no error in it and hence I'll press enter and I'll drag my function. So 
that's it we are done if you notice wherever there is east or west it is zone 1 and when there is north and south it is zone 2. So this was how you create an if and or combination function. I hope you all have understood this uh, simple example and how to write the syntax. In case you have any doubts please let me know in the comments section. Till then thank you so much for attending this session. I will see you in my next video.